It's an historic day at the Asaba International Airport in Delta State after years of negotiations on how, who, and when the facility will be concessioned. After an extensive bid process, which spanned a period of five years, with two major consortia emerging in the last round of bidding, the FIDC Menzies Consortium is now to operate as the master concessionaire. Our long-term development plan is to transform the Asaba International Airport into an airport city whose infrastructure, land use and economy are centered around the airport. The signing ceremony is next to formally adopt all agreements. In the agreements, the concession company will now be known as the Asaba Airport Company Limited, expected to work with technical partners as sub-concessionaires. The state governor shares details of the long and short-term expectations. It is their duty to manage the airport and develop the various strategic business units in the form of cargo business and the development of the cargo terminal, development of the logistics hub and cargo warehouses, the operation and management of the tank farm, the development and management of the business park, the development and management of the hotel and convention center, an airline operating out of Asaba International Airport as an operational hub, aircraft maintenance, repair, and overhaul MRO facility. And the Ministry of Aviation lends support to this concessioning plan. We are the aviation agencies, by what we have seen, what is being envisaged for this airport to be tr uh, transformed. Uh, the scope of our activities are definitely going to increase tremendously. While the airport has undergone a rehabilitation and reconstruction of its runway, taxiway and other ancillary works, leading to an upgrade of the airport to Category 6, parties here believe this concession is a viable option for the airport to be run more professionally and profitably.